I am tackling the girls' room, which is super bad. There's baby Max sleeping, getting so big. You guys, look how big he's getting. Oh, baby boy. Oh, shit. Sorry. I am tackling the huge pile of laundry that was in the laundry room because I want to make the laundry room cute again. It's just like not cute anymore. It's filled with laundry and like laundry products and laundry soap and I want to get the laundry soap and the detergent and the powder and the beads, the laundry beads that smell good. I want to get all that stuff in cute containers and cute like packaging and cute um just make it look cute so my goal today is to i'm not gonna get all the laundry done in one day but i'm gonna try to make it in two days so today is tuesday tomorrow's wednesday so tuesday and wednesday i'm gonna be doing a lot of laundry sophia's home with mom because she doesn't have school or preschool today hi so sophia oh are you in a bad mood today So, you guys, my nose is swollen, my eyes are swollen, especially this one. I have pink eye, or I have some infection going on in my eye, but I asked you guys over on Instagram, on my stories, if you follow me, if you guys still wanted me to vlog today having pink eye and looking like this, and you guys said yes. So, turning on the camera, vlogging it is, coming on to say hi to you guys, so... Yeah, I woke up yesterday morning. I thought there, I wore contacts. I wore like negative 725 contacts, if you know what that means. It's super bad. And I have stigmatisms in both of my eyes. But yesterday morning, I woke up to super discomfort in this eye, in my right eye. And it felt like, it felt like if you wear contacts, do you know what a rip feels like in your contact? Or like an air bubble I like a piece of sand in there so I was automatically I was like oh my gosh my contact has a rip in it I don't have any more contacts left I need to go to Costco fill my prescription to order more and so I went all day and it's just like running leaking tears all day yesterday I went all day with the contact in my eye because I didn't have any more contacts just thought it was my contact I couldn't take my contact out because I don't have any more so I just grinned and bared it all day yesterday and then in the middle of the night yesterday I was like oh my gosh this is too painful like I need to take my contact out so I took my contact out at like three in the morning and you guys my eye still hurt and it still felt like there was a rip or a piece of sand in my eye so obviously it wasn't my contact it's my eye so I called my my eye doctor this morning at like 802 this morning when I was getting the girls ready for school and I was like look I need to come in I have an infection in my eye and they're like okay we'll get you in at 11 so me Sophia and Max are going in today at 11 hopefully they can give me some antibiotics and I can get my eye cleared up because it hurts pretty bad any light from the outside or any light inside is like I'm so sensitive to light my eye hurts it feels like it's just itchy and it feels like there's like a little tiny pebble or a little tiny piece of sand in there it just hurts if you wear contacts you know exactly what I'm talking about so yeah just focusing on laundry today I have Valentine's stuff to show you guys today I need to go to the dollar store and pick up some little buckets that I hope they're there crossing my fingers because I'm gonna make um and show you guys on camera how to make teachers valentine's gifts so cute you guys so yeah welcome back to my channel my name is chrissy if you are new here baby's waking up the laundry comes all the way over here and yes my tree is still up you guys ridiculous i'm actually gonna take it down today but i'm gonna start folding laundry only have a little bit left and then i'm gonna get it all hung up and put away in the drawers Water 
And if you can hear Max out there crying, single mom life, trying to get one of them ready while he's crying, is no good. Here. Here, this one. No, no, this one. This one, honey. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Okay, there. Look cute. Mama. Mama. My running errands Mama. and pink eye hey. outfit. <laughs> Mama. What? Yes. Why? Oh, really? So cool. Yeah. I got it. Got it? I got it. Okay. Okay, we're coming. We're coming. Don't if you do anything. Tell you. Tell me I'm coming soon. <laughs> Open the door. Is it so hard? There we go. Mama, Somebody is the wide the awake. Hi. Is the <laughs> Hi, babes. I'm sitting right here, honey. Always on some sort of device. Kids these days. Whether it's a phone, tablet, laptop, computer, always on devices. But it saves my sanity, so. Sometimes that TV or that phone or the tablet saves my life while I'm in the shower or I'm trying to get cooking done or something. So it's just not good to watch too much of it. But I'm here in the optometrist's office and just waiting to be seen by the doctor. I got these cropped vests from Shein. I got three cropped vests. One of them is tan and reversible baby pink. And then I got this white one. And then I got a dark brown one. And then I got two like Kim Kardashian sweats. The ones that are kind of like chunky. And they're all from Shein. And it was like 50 bucks for my full order. So when I get home, I will show you guys all that stuff. And then I'll link everything also in the comments because it's super cute. He was asleep and then he opened his eyes. Yeah. Okay, don't mess with them, okay? The girls got new sweaters. Their dad took them shopping. And here, turn this down. They ate pasta when they were eating this, or when they were wearing this, and Sophia got a ton of stains all over. So I showed you guys over on Instagram how I get rid of their stains, and all the stains came out. Mama, I can't glasses because my eyes are. 
Okay, Sophia's going potty and we are in the bathroom and the doctor gave me some numbing drops and then he put some antibiotics in my eye and gave me a prescription to my pharmacy. I'm gonna go pick them up and then we're gonna head over to the dollar store and then Costco. We're sitting outside of Costco and we're just quickly gonna run in. Um, I always say that and then I come out with a whole cart full of stuff. I always say, I only need a little bit of stuff. And then I come out with a big old cart overflowing. I am aiming to only get a few things. I need some shrimp and some Catalina Crunch Keto and some salmon, um, some flank steaks and a few other things. So, Oh, and then the Jimmy Dean um, light, the diet sandwiches that are on sale right now that are on coupon. I'm hungry right now too, you guys, so. Hi. I'm getting lots of fish, got salmon burgers. These are so good. I used to eat these all the time at my mom's house. And some cod. Some wild Argentinian red shrimp. And the best frozen salmon, farm raised Atlantic salmon. So good. Sophia got a hot dog and a lemonade and I got a pizza, pepperoni pizza. Still wearing my glasses because my eyes hurt, so not trying to look cool or nothing, just my eyes are sensitive to the light. The girls are home from school, so it's going to be a lot of noise. Um, me and Sophia and Max just got home at 3 o'clock and the girls get out of school at 3.45, so we've been home for 45 minutes and I've literally been alternating both boobs for MJ and he's just been going to town. He was super hungry after Costco. So he's nice and content. I'm gonna run outside and get all the Costco groceries and then give you guys a Costco haul. I'm just going to quickly go through everything that we got. We got some naan. Um, we've never had these tiny mini ones, but I'm sure they taste just like the big ones. So we got some mini naan dippers. I used to eat these Alaskan salmon burgers all the time at my mom's with lime, you guys. They're so good. So with some avocado oil or some olive oil in a pan, lightly drizzle, and then just fry up the salmon burger and eat them with themselves, a tortilla or some bread. Mm, so, so good. So yummy and so healthy for you. I'm breastfeeding and um, spinach has a ton of vitamin A, vitamin C, folate, um, folic acid, a ton of good vitamins and nutrients for breastfeeding and for your breast milk and for your babe. So I got a huge bag of this. I'm getting ready to do a what I eat in a day while breastfeeding video. So this is always good to have on hand. Carb balanced tortillas for fish tacos, for eggs, 
literally anything um, that you can eat a tortilla with. This is just for me since I am watching my diet and watching my weight. Feta crumbles for a salad that I'm gonna be making tonight with salmon that I got from Costco that I will show you guys in a little bit. And I'll show you guys a salad in a little bit. Guavital, it makes your clothes smell amazing. And this is super cheap. This whole thing for 160 full ounces was $7.99. Some cocktail cucumbers. Shukri is home from school and she's already dug into these. She loves these. She'll eat like half of a bag in one sitting. So I try to get these like once a week. We love soup. So I got Thai coconut curry soup. Um, clam chowder, me and all the kids love clam chowder. Simply granola. This is so good for in the middle of the night to crave any sweet tooth. Cheerios, oat crunch, cinnamon. This looks super good. You guys, I went to Costco hungry in the middle of the day. So if you see all this extra stuff, that's why. But at least it's all extra healthy stuff. Are you talking, baby? We got some acai bowls. These are so good also for in the middle of the night. Simple Meals almond flour. I heard that these are super good. I haven't tasted them yet, but I got some um, fried pickle and ranch dip that Sophia tasted at Costco today with some Lay's ruffled chips, no, some ruffles and she loved the dip so i got the dip and then instead of getting chips for the dip i got these almond flour crackers so hopefully these are as good as the hype is wild argentine red shrimp if you guys watch juliana loves glam on youtube and on instagram she did a costco haul recently and her and tone love these shrimp and they swear by them so i went out and bought them there's no preservatives no chemicals added they are wild caught and they are peeled and veined. So they look really yummy. You can make shrimp tacos with these, pastas, just have them as meal prep. Juliana loves glam. Also got this Catalina Crunch and I tasted it because I was like craving something sweet on my way home. So I busted it open in the car on my way home from Costco. And it is Catalina Crunch cinnamon toast. It is so good, you guys. If you're gonna do salmon, obviously do fresh, but the best frozen salmon that I have found is this farm-raised Kirkland Signature Atlantic Salmon. So, so good. We're gonna be having this for dinner tonight with the sweet kale salad and some white rice. So good, you guys. Wild caught Alaskan, Pacific caught, wild caught Alaska Pacific cod, hand trimmed, boneless, skinless, super good. Kirkland Signature again, yum. I was craving fish, obviously. Some pure organic layered fruit bars. These are so good. We normally buy these in the summer to throw in the diaper bags and our beach bags when we go down to the rivers, beach, and lake. And these are yummy. The kids love them. I love them. Liquid IV is on sale at Costco right now. I got the strawberry kind. I have a sponsorship with them, but I ran out of the liquid IV. So I just went ahead and picked up some of mine. This is not sponsored or anything. This is just on my own recognizance, I love liquid IV, especially for breastfeeding. We got some Bavarian meats. These are actually made in Seattle, which is like three hours away from us. These are super good. These are high in protein, zero sugar, and gluten-free. We always get a rotisserie chicken. Never leave Costco without one. They're $4.99, and we always have these on hand for snacks. This is like our third one this week. I love to eat these with these croissants so good these are 4.99 i also never leave costco without one of these the girls will tear this up in like a day and a half two days tops we got some scented kitchen bags that we desperately needed we didn't have any garbage bags for the longest time i got two things of egg bites i've never seen these on sale and these are on sale for two dollars off so they were 8.99 instead of 11.99 last year they were 9.99 and then they went to 10.99 and now they're 11.99 we got some Siete almond flour tortillas. These are super yummy. Yeah, they're super yummy. Um, the Ziploc storage bags. These will last me like six months. I go through and two of these packages like a year, and these are on sale right now. So these are also really good for summertime. Throw them in the beach bags, the diaper bags. Have them in the car. Have them in my purse. Trail mix snack packs. Super, super good. Um, very heart healthy, obviously, because of the nuts, but there's heart healthy mix, omega-3 deluxe mix, and cranberry health mix. Layla, super good. There's cranberries and pumpkin seeds, and walnuts, Brazil nuts, pepitas, 
almonds, pecans. Oh, this is the fried pickle and ranch dip. I normally get the jalapeno and artichoke dip, you guys. Gosh, it's so good. If you have had it down in the comments, let me know. The artichoke and jalapeno dip, so bomb, you guys. It is so delicious. You can eat it with chips, crackers, fruit, not fruit, um, vegetables, literally anything. It's so yummy. And it comes in a big thing like this and it's like $6.99. Instead of buying that today, I bought the fried pickle and ranch dip because Sophia tasted it at one of the um, sample spots and she loved it. So I got a whole thing. I just figured if Sophia liked it, probably her sisters will like it. Oh, I can't talk. If Sophia liked it, her sisters will probably like it. So I got the big one and this was $6.99. Oh, shook, look. Yum. She found one in the fridge yesterday and she's like, mm, Mom, is this good? And I was like, ah, I haven't bought any Baby Bell in like a year. So, no, that's not good. I cleaned the fridge out yesterday and I found some little strays of these and they were like super hard. So, anyway, she said she wanted some. So, all the kids love them. I got a big package of them. I got some strawberries. We got some five pack of avocados. This is a sweet kale salad. I've talked about this before. It is so good, you guys. So, so yummy. It has seven superfoods. It has broccoli, cabbage, kale, chicory, Brussels sprouts, dried cranberries, pumpkin seeds, and then it comes with a poppy seed dressing. So crunchy, so good. It goes so well with the salmon, the frozen salmon that I got, the Atlantic salmon. I'm gonna throw that in the oven with some spices and some lemon on it, and then I'm gonna have this on the side, add some sliced apples and some feta cheese, you guys. So good. With white rice or brown rice, yum. And last but not least, we got some stir fry, stir fry vegetable blend, and then some super sweet corn. I'm trying to talk fast because I'm trying to get through this fast because I don't want the baby to end up crying. I just fed him. He should be fine for a little bit. The girls have him, but who knows? Okay, so since there's been an egg shortage, let me know if there's an egg shortage where you live, but where I live in the Tri-Cities, Washington, there is a huge egg shortage. There hasn't been any eggs at Walmart or Winco for like weeks. So I stopped at Yolks and I got eggs. I went to um, Winco or Costco thinking there would be eggs but I forgot to get them oh and I forgot to get the hard-boiled eggs too my bad um the girls really wanted hard-boiled eggs I just completely didn't even go into the milk or the egg part so when I go back next week I'll have to look for the eggs and the hard-boiled eggs so I stopped at yolks on my way home and I got some oat milk creamer this is in okay can I see your baby oh I was gonna say what's the flavor french vanilla and then I got some raw kombucha. This is raspberry chai. This is supposed to look really good. Or chia. These, it's filled with chia seeds. I got some hazelnut coffee creamer. I'm trying to save money. I'm not a coffee person. I normally drink my Red Bull Italian sodas that are flavored with cherry. But instead of going to the coffee shop every day and spending $10 on a drink, I am starting to drink coffee at home. And I'm not drinking it for the flavor. I'm not drinking it because I like the taste or anything like that. I'm drinking it to give me that boost that I need and it's saving me money. It's saving me a trip from going to the st from going to my mom and pop corner store and getting that $10 Red Bull every day. Also at Yolks, we got some yummy yogurt. We got raspberry cream and vanilla cream. We got some Quest chips. I got spicy sweet chili and ranch flavored. These have really good macros on them. They're 19 grams of protein and four grams of net carbs. So if you're trying to watch your weight or you just had a baby or anything like that, if you like crunch from chips, these are really good chips to get into. I like to eat avocado toast or nut butter toast. So I got 21 whole grains and seeds, thin sliced Dave's Killer bread. This is the bread that I like to eat my avocado toast and my nut butter bread with. And then I got the girls white bread done right, Dave's Killer bread. Here's the eggs that I got. I got three of them. So I got 36 eggs. This should last us for the week. Okay, and now Target haul. Um, I didn't go to Yolks, Costco, and Target all in one day. I went to Target a few days ago and just barely got everything out of my car. So these are Quest cookies. These are the same brand as the chips. 
Um, these are frosted cookies. These are five grams of protein and one grab of one gram of net carbs. So these also have really good um, macros. One gram of sugar. Plus, how cute is the packaging, you guys? I'm such a sucker for cute packaging. I got an Alani energy drink for tomorrow. And then I want to make some curry. So I got some garbanzo beans and then some cannellini beans. I got these at TJ Maxx recently, a two pack of Valentine's bags. They say love on them. I figure I can just take these to the beach this summer and then I can use them right now for the Valentine season to put all of my new Valentine stuff in, like all of my snacks and all of my teacher gifts and ideas that I have for you guys over on Instagram in these bags for right now. I'm getting ready to film my Valentine's decorate with me and um, decorate my house lightly in Valentine stuff. So I got this super cute table runner from Target. And then I got these mauve pink. This is like a true mauve pink bowls. You guys, these are 50 cents. The cups are 50 cents and they have all different colors. And the plates are 50 cents. I got two of each. And I got these three bins from the Target dollar spot. They were $3 each. I got these for the girls for when we're in the car and we stop at McDonald's and get Happy Meals or when we get kids meals in places. Oh, we forgot to go to the dollar store. Dang it. There were these um, packages, these containers that I wanted to put the teacher's gifts in. I'm going to have to go tomorrow when the girls are at school. I'll go in the morning when I drop Sophia off at preschool. Dang it. How did I forget that? Oh, you guys will get the idea when I show you what I'm going to do tonight. And then I'll finish them in the next vlog when I have the containers from the dollar store. But I got, look how cute these milk chocolate and strawberry white chocolate hot drink cocoa bombs are you guys so cute they're filled with mini marshmallows how cute are the colors they were $3.99 or $4.99 at target i got three for the girls teachers preschool kindergarten and first grade and then i got three for the girls for their love baskets that i'm going to be making i got poppy every time there is like Christmas or Valentine's or anything like that, we make teacher's baskets and I always give the teachers one of these for their birthday or for the Valentine's baskets or whatevs, but super cute packaging and I love the pink. Let me show you the shade of pink. And I'm gonna be adding these to the teacher's Valentine's baskets. Look how cute. So cute. And all the pink's gonna match. <laughs> These are also for the kids' as teachers. These are, I don't even know why these are out. I accidentally put them out, but these are for the girls' love baskets. These are also for the girls' love baskets. These are for a treat that I'm gonna be making for the girls. I'm gonna be showing you guys on Instagram how to make it. When I make treats and stuff on Instagram, do you guys want me to show you on YouTube also? It might be a little bit more difficult for me to film for Instagram and YouTube, but I can if you guys want me to. I'll figure out a way. Um, if you're not following me on Instagram, follow me over there for treats and DIYs. I do a lot of that stuff over there. I don't do so much of that on my YouTube channel, but I do most of my DIYs and my sweet treats and holiday seasonal things like that over on my Instagram. So make sure to follow me, Chrissy Doll 2015 So yeah, I'm gonna be putting these finger paints for the bathtub in the girls' love baskets. These are in the Target dollar spot for a dollar. And then these hearts are Silly Scents. They're dough, pretty much just Crayola Play-Doh, and I'm gonna be putting those in the girls' heart, the love baskets also. And these were also $1. The hot cocoa spoons, how stinking cute are these, you guys? These are so cute. And then look how cute these are. They're gummy Lunchables. The girls haven't seen these yet, but they're so cute. Gummy cracker stackers, buildable gummy candy, you guys. So cute. These are also at Target. Yeah. 